You've had much better days, Petros. Stop laughing and bring the stick back. No, why should I? I hate cold water. Coward. You threw it in, so it's up to you to get it out again. Let's toss for it. No. You really are a hothead. Look here, Uzo. An old bottle. So what? Is there anything in it, at least? Looks like a note. Maybe it's a secret message or something. A message in a bottle? Come on, then. You're right, Uzo. It's a message in a bottle. Who's it from? Don't know. There's nothing on it except pictures. Pictures are better anyway. Hey! Hey! Where are you off to? What's wrong with Petros? It looks like he's been uh, bitten by a tarantula. Has something happened? Have you seen a sea monster? No, something much better. Message in a bottle. Cool. But it's a treasure map. Can't figure it out, though. Maybe you should turn the page around. No, it doesn't look any better that way. Maybe it's not a treasure map after all. It's probably just some stupid scribblings. I'm sure. It's right. Forget it. Let's play something else. If I think just a little... Petros! Petros! Your mom's calling. Come on now. Time to eat. What's wrong with you? You look like you were caught in the rain. I found a message in a bottle. And that's why you're making that face? Isn't it exciting? Yes, yes but I just can't read it. Give it to me. Hmm. I'm none the wiser either. Strange scribbling. And what if it means something? I suggest you sleep on it. Sometimes the best ideas come to you in sleep. He's still studying that funny note. Has anything occurred to you in the meantime? Not yet, but I'm sure there's a secret message. Petros is crazy. Let's go. Yeah, maybe catching. Well, if I get rich, I won't give you any. Let them go. Did you hear that? Ow, ow. Sounds like Grandpa. You dumb beast, let go! Ow! Get lost! Ow! Dumb beast! Ow! Get off of me! What's up, Grandpa? Look, this dumb crab actually bit me in the finger. That's right. Huh? Yeah, that's right. Just laugh. What note is that? I found it yesterday. It's a message in a bottle. But we can't read it, and the others say it's just stupid scribblings. Hmm. Well, let me see it. Hmm. Hmm. Can you figure anything out? Hmm. The signs are somehow familiar, but I can't seem to remember. Ah, uh, time. Uh... Come on, try, Grandpa. I am now. Hmm. Where have I seen these signs like this before? In the newspaper? Rubbish. Must have been in some book. I'll figure it out. I've got it! Here's the book. Those are the exact same signs. Right! And next to them is what they mean in our language. Now, we can translate the pictures. Quicker, Grandpa. Yes, yes, don't rush me. Yes, that's, mm-hmm. Petros, I think you found something very special here. What is it? Come on out with it. I think you've discovered the way to Atlantis. Atlantis? What's that? Atlantis? Atlantis is a sunken city that people have been searching for for hundreds of years! A sunken city? You mean a city at the bottom of the sea? That's exactly what I mean! And there are people living there? I mean, if the message comes from the city, someone must have sent it. Exactly! 
Many people believe that there are people there, but nobody knows. It's been many hundreds of years since Atlantis went down. It's amazing. And this note tells us how to get to Atlantis? If I'm not wrong, yes. But what do you want to do in a sunken city? I don't want to go there. Then stay here. We must tell everybody and then get an expedition together. That's what we must do. Grandpa, could you read the message, but it's just the way to a sunken city? A sunken city? Unfortunately, I'd have preferred a real treasure. But a sunken city's fabulous. It's no joke, I'm absolutely certain. This plan will lead us to Atlantis. And you can tell from that that these are just silly scribblings. Really, I don't know, Grandpa. You've got yourself into something there, I really think. A message in a bottle is just a joke. It's okay for pictures to fall, but for you... Uh, you're not listening to me properly. Let me explain it to you in more detail. Now, be reasonable, Grandpa. You're making Pedro's quite crazy. Come on, everybody. Let's get back to work. I think Grandpa's going senile. Well, I mean, at his age. I'll give you senile. Just wait and see. Why don't they believe you, Grandpa? The only thing they believe is what they can see and touch. Shall we throw the note away? Hardly give me until tomorrow. Maybe I'll come up with something. Senile. Hmm. Well, we'll see about that. We'll see who's senile around here. <laughs> Have you come up with something, Grandpa? Oh, yes, but it's risky. <laughs> that doesn't sound bad. Let's wait and see. It's always been my dream to find Atlantis, and now with this plan, I'll never get a chance like this again. This doesn't sound good at all. What do you mean, Grandpa? What do you intend to do? That means I intend to go alone on the search without any help. But I found the plan. I'm going along. Are you really sure about that? As sure as can be. And what about me? You have to decide that for yourself. Now, on the spot? You can take your time, Uzo. We first have to make this boat seaworthy. Well, then there's hope yet. That'll never happen. Looks like new. Yeah, we did pretty well. Oops. Hmm. <laughs> I thought I'd been bitten by a crab again. So you're coming with us, Uzo? Don't get much choice. Can let you two go alone. Well now, nothing can go amiss. Off we go, due south. Grandpa, flying fish. Yes, isn't it great fun? Finally, a real journey by the sea. It's just a little storm, that's all. I'm a bit afraid, Grandpa. Oh, yes, the storm is not as small as I thought. Hang on tight. Oh! Oh! Ah! Ah! Oh, is it over, Grandpa? 